introduction which is Tony Castle today. Today I will make a weekly vlog. First we make first we cut a circle and then we and then we fold it into half then quarter and once more we can fold and and and, and we open it and you see these lines Big hand with the material is a card, a card, a thick paper of card, and then we paste it. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. Today, I read the Mera from Class 5. size craft paper, color pencils, glitter pens and sketches, scale and pencil for the diagrams. So and it's hand using cardboard and glitter pens. So first of angles so first when I put this orange one angle uh, orange one arrow right here in 90 degree and the blue one in 0 degree which angle does it forms can you guess yes it forms a right angle when an angle is equal to 90 degree that is called right angle now next example so now when we put when I will put this orange one right here in 145 degree and the blue one in 0 degree, which angle does it form? Yes, it forms an acute angle. When, when an angle is smaller than 90 degree is called acute angle. It is equal to 45 degree. Next example. When we put the orange one right in 135 degree and the blue one in 0 degree which angle does it form? Yes, it forms an, octu an obtuse angle the angle which is larger, larger than 90 degree is called obtuse angle now, now when we put the orange one right in 180 degree and the blue one in 0 degree which angle does it form? It forms a straight angle. When two lines are straight, it is called a straight angle. Now last example. When we put the orange one right in 0 and the blue one also in 0, which angle does it forms? It forms a 0 angle. That's all for today. Thank you and have a nice day. Good evening sir. Today I am Tejas Sutri of class 5A. Tell how to make a degree club. First of all, we cut a circle out of a paper, fold it into half, fold it once more into quarter and fold it once more and then open the paper. You will see light lines like this and mark the light lines into dark with sketch pen and now I tell how to make arrow. First of all, how to make a first arrow. First of all, we make a drawing of arrow with pencil and color with a black sketch pen and erase the pencil and then we then we cut a thick paper into small piece and draw a arrow like this as shown here. degree and 180 degree and then when the 
arrow moves in the front it means 90 degree or a right angle and then it moves in this side it is 45 degree good afternoon sir today i am vilakshi patel of class 5th day i am going to discuss about degree clock so let's start first we take a paper we draw a circle and cut it then we fold it on half then quarter and once more then we open the paper we saw lines like this we fill lines we fill lines with sketch pen then we mark angles like 0 degree 45 degree 90 degree 180 degree then we make a arrow like this towards 0 degree then we take a cardboard we draw arrow arrow on it and cut it then we fix with our pin etc. Then, so the degree clock is ready. Then the arrow moves 45 degree. It's it's mean it's acute angle or less than 90 degree or 45. The arrow moves 90 degree, it's mean right angle more than 45 degree and less than 180 degree. When the arrow moves here, it's mean it it means 135 degree. It it's mean a acute sorry obtuse angle. Sorry, it's obtuse angle. When the arrow moves 180 degree, it's me. It's me. Obtuse angle and straight angle. When the arrow moves here, here it's me. Uh, more than it's mean relax. Uh, more than 180 degree or it's me reflex angle. Thank you. First, my name is Kartike Partial. I study in class 53. Today I make a degree clock. I make an angle in it like 90 degree, 55 degree, 10 degree and 180 degree. I also write the name of angle. Name as acute angle, right angle, obtuse angle. My name is Paraswati. I study in class 5th B. I make a degree clock. I take a craft paper and cut circle out of a paper. Fold into a circle. Then fold it again to quarter. Fold it once again. Open the paper. Open the paper. You will see the line like this. Now mark. First, we make 
first we cut a circle and then we and then we fold it into half then quarter and once more we can fold and and and, and we open it and you see these lines and then we mark 180 degree 90 degree 45 degree 0 degree and we we uh, we may make a small hand and then we make a big hand when the material is a card a card a thick paper of card and then we paste it thank you Out of paper, fold it into half, fold it one again into a quarter, fold it once more. Open, open the paper. You will see lines like this. Now mark 0 degree, 45 degree, 90 degree and 180 degree as shown. From the center draw one hand make a green hand which are thick paper and fix it uh, it to the center which are drawing pin so that it is free to move paste in my copy
afternoon sir i am aditya mandali of class 5c i made a degree clock using different angles that is 180 degree 0 degree 45 degree and 90 degree here right angle is equals to 90 degree acute angle is equals to 45 degree which is less than right angle obtuse angle is equals to 180 degree which is more than right angle thank you good morning i am dikshan negi of class 50c i make a degree clock using different angles that is 0 degree 45 degree 90 degree 180 degree here acute angle is equals to 45 degree right angle is equals to 90 degree obtuse angle is equals to 180 degree thank you sir